we all get to choose what we believe. And that is so powerful that whatever we do believe gets reinforced. Have you noticed? Doesn't matter what side of the aisle someone's on, they will defend it with their life because they're getting evidence of what they already believe. So let's talk about some ideas of how to get really good at discernment. I'll share how I do it personally. Whenever I hear any content at all, there are two main things that I look for. And it's not whether or not I agree with what the person is saying. The first thing is what is the emotional state of the person that is speaking? Are they anxious, fearful, powerful, powerless, whatever? And if I can sense that their nervous system is dysregulated and they're not speaking from a place of peace, ding ding it doesn't mean that what they're saying isn't valid it just is in all things being valid as a perspective i know that there has got to be a higher perspective available to me second thing i look for does the narrative that the person is talking about involve any us and them any better than less than and if so although a valid way that they can see it i know that there's always a higher perspective available. All right, so you don't have to believe what I'm gonna say, but I'm gonna ask you this. Do you really think that there is a spiritual truth that disqualifies anyone? And if you do, what does oneness mean to you? What does unity mean to you? 